The Asman Kamama led National Administration and Security Committee, Defense and Foreign Relations, and the Justice and Legal Affairs Committees were today in day long deliberations that saw proposed amendments from various lobby groups to the controversial bill received and harmonized, and the proposal seeking to limit media freedom by granting police the power to okay pictures to be published was one of the areas that has been targeted for amendments with the proposal that the task be shifted to the Media Council. These amendments came as a result of the many memorandums and both oral and written submitted by different institutions and citizens of our country, including bodies like CIC, Kenya National Human Rights Commission, the Muslim uh, Jamia Mosque. Another proposed amendment to the National Intelligence Act is seeking to have the National Intelligence Service retain powers to arrest suspected criminals as proposed in the bill, but have them immediately surrender the suspect to the nearest police station. A counterterrorism center was also proposed to be established. Matters that are unconstitutional have been, have been properly addressed. Uh, matters that are touching on human rights have been properly and adequately addressed. So I think, uh, and all the views that were given by Kenyans to our committees were actually uh, taken on board. So, so there should be no worry. Independent Police Oversight Authority has opposed the provision by pushing for an amendment that will see NIS also required to abide by the same rules as the police when undertaking a swoop or moving to arrest. IPOA argues that the police are required to maintain human rights standards which should be complied by any officer charged with the responsibility of carrying out an arrest. An amendment has also been introduced that will see the Director of Registrations issue a 15 days notice before revoking any identity card and publish the names in a gazette notice within 14 days. Section 51, subsection A of the Public Order Act that sought to have anyone organizing a public meeting without the consent of the police was deleted. We are not bringing any amendment, or whether in the bill or from the committees, that is unconstitutional. Members of Parliament will consider the proposals at the Committee of the Whole House during tomorrow's special sitting. Marion Canary, Channel 1.